Stacy, back to the scene of the crime. Uh, talk to me about what it's like to be back here. Oh, it's awesome. Um, just walking around and playing the course again for the first time since uh, winning last year. I mean, you go around and you remember certain holes and certain shots, and just to see your name on the bridge as I walked over 18, was it was pretty awesome. Was there one particular place that you stopped for a moment and just kind of smiled and said, yeah, I remember this? Uh, I definitely found where I putted from on 17 when I made that part, but I definitely kind of, I think I was right here just off the fringe and the hole was right here, so um, definitely went there. Talk about your level of confidence when you come in here, because in speaking to major winners, mm -hmm. it separates you from a lot of players and maybe gives you a little bit more relaxation when you come into a major? Yeah, I mean, I love hard golf courses. I always seem to play pretty well in hard courses. And so, um, and there's definitely comfort level on this course. I just, I, I feel comfortable on the tee shots and there's not too many that are just awkward and you're not really comfortable with. So, um, I don't know, it's just, a, it's a good place for me and, and having good memories definitely helps. You're a player who seems to be able to manage her game fairways and greens and obviously it's very important in an event like this. Oh, for sure. I think, I mean, hitting in the fairways is the most important thing here. Uh, the rough is... The rough's not as high as it's been in the past, but um, just hitting the fairways and then having really good speed on the greens. Talk about what your success has done for you. You, you suffered with scoliosis mm -hmm. as a youngster, and, and that's really helped you reach out to a lot of people around the country. It has. It's given me a lot of opportunities to inspire people. And uh, turning pro, I didn't think that would really come up that much, but it's, uh, it's become part of who I am. And um, at that time, going through what I did, it was just something that I thought I'd have to go through and I'd be done with it. And um, sometimes you want to just be known for your golf, but um, it's also nice to have that and nice to inspire people. Now, I've been talking to ladies about the uniqueness of Poppy's Pond. Mm -hmm. You don't see it anywhere else in golf, yeah. but you've got a plan. Some girls have plans and, and you've got a plan <laughs> for this year. Yeah, if I win, me and my mom are just going in. She has to redeem herself after last year. All right, final thing. Just, mm -hmm. just talk about um, being ready now. It's Wednesday afternoon. Mm -hmm. You know, the fun and games are over, and now right. it's back to business. Right. It's uh, you got to kind of finish some last things that I wanted to work on, and I mean, you really got to. If you're not, if you don't have it now, though, you got to, <laughs> you got to be ready. And so it's just a few little things this afternoon, but uh, my game feels good, and I feel ready to go. Thanks so much for your time. Good luck this week. All right. Thank you.